All right, and now we want to uh, chat about, have you gotten your gifts? I mean, your, your list, it's, you've got so many people, and this is really, really cool. I love that there are ways you can help people around the world, but you can also get the gifts you want for people on your list. I have Miss Lyndon Baker in studio with me. She is the owner and founder of Fairkind. Lyndon, thanks for being here. Thank you. Okay, Lyndon, I, I think this is amazing. You and I both spent time in Uganda uh, doing some service work, and you decided, you know what, there's so many amazing products being made. I need to bring them back to the US. Yeah, exactly. So, you know, like you said, both spending time in Uganda, when me, for me when I was there, I realized there's all these amazing artisan groups that are making these gorgeous products and don't really have a market to sell them in. Yeah, and they are so talented. I mean, I, I think there was something so wonderful about supporting them, and I have some amazing wooden things uh, that I brought back, and I brought back for my entire family, and everybody loves them. So here's you. Tell us about your time in Uganda. Yeah, so for me, I was working just side by side with artisans and really getting to know them and um, seeing their struggles and um, kind of what their their working process was and what they needed. Um, and uh, so kind of coming back, realized that, hey, this is an opportunity to really connect those artisans and give them some more markets to sell their products in. Yeah, and it's true. I mean, it's their livelihood. Making these products, you know, that we value so much, it is completely the livelihood for their family. So tell us how fair trade works. Yeah, so with fair trade, um, the standards mean that the products are made in safe, healthy work environments. Um, and then above that, and most importantly, it means that they're paid a proper fair trade wage mm -hmm. so that the money they're making for each product is going to allow them to have um, proper housing to get nutritional meals and all those things and that's how you founded fair kind so the products you have in front of us tell us about them and where they're from yes we have a couple collections here this is our Tunisia collection this olive wood um, so these are all handcrafted from start to finish in Tunisia um, it's this beautiful olive wood um, and each piece is so unique it really has its own um, different wood engravings and wood engravings and details and it's really cool and then we've got our Ankole horn collection here this is handcrafted in Uganda um, made with up cycled horn as a food byproduct. So everything is ethically sourced and handmade from start to finish. Explain to them, because I, I think I know from being there, but explain to them the upcycling they do from the cow horns, because uh, it's something that would go to waste, right? Exactly, yeah. So just the regular beef cows there have these huge, gorgeous horns, um, but normally they're just thrown away. And so these are actually upcycled as a food byproduct. And the artisans have found a way to kind of mold them and um, create these beautiful products. And each piece has very unique horn striations and color coloring that you know, makes it not identical to any other one. And you know, I have some that are similar to that. Um, there are these wooden salad, uh, you know, a salad dish, and of course the utensils to go with it. And every single time I pull it out, everybody is always like, wow, where did you get this? It's such a talker piece for whether you're hosting a party or it's something if you give it to someone, talk about the story they can tell, right? Absolutely, yeah. I mean, I think th some of these items are such good hostessing gifts. Mm -hmm. um, but again, just like you said, they're such conversation starters. Yeah. Um, and great pieces to have on the table. Yeah, so uh, you source from both of those places so far, Tunisia and Uganda. What's upcoming for you? So we have a few new collections in the works. Um, I can't share too much, but you know, I, I've worked over the years with artisans all over the place in Morocco, Peru, Rwanda. Um, so we're really excited to bring some more products to everyone. Perfect, so how do they get your products? So you can just order them online. So on our website, fairkind.com. Yep. Easy enough. They can also follow you on social media at Fairkind, and there you probably are posting, you know, various things about the products you have, as well as how it's giving back to others around the world because they really are making this income, and it's so impactful for them and their families. Absolutely, yeah. And what's cool too is that every product comes packaged with a postcard and a limited edition tag that really explains the story behind it and exactly how the products are made. How oh, cool! I love it. Well, I, I mean, Lyndon, you're amazing for doing this because I have thoughts about it, but I never put it into <laughs> action. So I applaud you. For for Thank doing this you. and I am going to go jump on your website and do a little shopping. Great to meet you. You too. Thank you.